A livery cab left riddled with bullets after a passenger jumped out of a moving car and fired at the driver in the Bronx. Police are searching for this man, the accused gunman. Tonight, there's a reward for information leading to his arrest. Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles is in the newsroom with information on what led to the shooting. Darla. Joe, the New York State Federation of Taxis is offering a $3,000 reward for anyone who can help identify the shooter. Now, the motive at this point is still undetermined. There could have been a plot to rob the driver at an alternate drop-off location, or the shooter could have simply been annoyed about his ride experience. At any rate, he fired off five shots. All five bullets hit his car, but the driver walked away uninjured, and today he says he is happy to be alive. This is a bullet that's lodged in here. Okay. Then you have three bullet holes, one here, one here. This is the wild, wild west moment. A livery driver's mid-sized SUV became riddled with bullet holes. When the bullet hit the side of the car, he said it was like, it felt like an explosion. Tuesday morning, you Felix Himignan standing alongside the New York State Federation of Taxis in the Mott Haven section of the Bronx, unraveling the details of a pickup that went off the rails nearly two weeks ago. He says, Yo que no iba a pasar nada. At first, I didn't think anything was going to happen. Everything was going well. He wasn't rude to me. He didn't say much at all. I think you got to go around that thing. Go around with what? Around this block, it's at the end. This is not the address. The 26-year-old driver picking up the fare just before 4 a.m. near Bronx Boulevard and Carpenter Avenue in Williamsbridge, who then started to argue with Himignan about the drop-off location. Let me see the address. Let me see the address. You talking about let you see the address? He didn't text it to me. He had it on his app. I didn't call you. Let me see. This isn't Uber, buddy. You get me tight. The passenger then jumping out of the SUV while it's moving and starts shooting at the vehicle. It was a very scary moment because it was metal, lead hitting metal. And it was just the sound alone was scary. He Mignon says he was not initially concerned about the passenger wearing a face mask because he's just used to it after the pandemic. If anyone has any information about this suspect, please call Crime Stoppers at 1-800-577-TIPS.